This exercise is a hip controlled articular rotation, or a hip card. Now the hips are like a support beam for the entire body. They help maintain posture in the torso, and they help walking gait in the lower body. Now, having immobile hips can lead to a lot of dysfunction down the line. It can lead to lower back pain, knee and ankle pain. So it's really important to have a healthy range of motion in the hips. These rotations are gonna help alleviate stiffness and achiness in the joint, as well as help restore some of that natural range of motion. Now let me walk you through it. This is gonna take us through the hip car. Um, now, one thing that you wanna always remember is that you wanna have full body tension when you're doing these exercises, right? So you need to be squeezing the glutes, squeezing the core, making sure that the only thing that's moving is the hip in this case, or whatever specific joint that you're working on for that exercise. So the next step, we're gonna move, we're gonna take this knee and foot, and we're gonna flex it across the body. Good, try to keep those hips in tight. Then you're gonna swing the leg out toward me. Perfect, now this is where it gets a little bit tough, so this is where I wanna give her a little guidance. Then we're gonna rotate and push back at the same time, right? So notice that the back didn't move too much, and the hips are staying nice and tight. And then you're gonna reverse it the same way going back, right? All oh, high as you can, try to keep those hips down, good. And then you're gonna go back across and down. All right, 